Need to get somewhere f f f f f f f quickly? Better run fast! See you, new kid. New kid, we're ready to start torturing the coon. We need your help. Come to Freedom Palace base. What is wrong with you guys? I am not your enemy! You're gonna talk, Cartman. New kid, you're going to have to make Cartman talk. What? What are you gonna do with that? You guys are wasting your time. I'm the Coon. Torture doesn't work against me, remember? So, so what? I, I just have to watch you eat? Is that it? I'm, I'm not afraid. Is that a cuttlefish? Oh, no, I, I prefer salmon myself. See? It, it doesn't even phase me. Guys, I really wish we could just wrap this up. No, oh, back. Not, no, not even a little bit. I can gobble those parts up. See? Yum, 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 yum. Guys, I really wish we could just wrap this up. No, oh, no, no, no. No, those parts don't bother me at all. Hit him again. Oh, jeez. Well, I, I guess we're done here, huh? Can someone reach around and get this knot? Oh, no, you're not gonna eat that vomit-covered broccoli. It's not organic. Oh, now that's pretty gross, you guys. Oh, God. Yeah, you guys might as well give up. They're not... <laughs> oh, no. oh, wait, 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 you guys! Oh my god! Oh, the, the cats! What cats? I just remembered! C Connor! I think the, the fudge jarred my memory. The, he said something about making cats more powerful than... The, the, yes, that's it! He must he must want to genetically alter the cats! The genetics lab, Dr. Mephesto. Yes, that must be it, Dad! Need to get somewhere f f f f f f f quickly? B better run fast! Catch you later! All right, the new kid's here. Come on, new kid. Can I help you? Yeah, hi, we signed up for the tour. Ah, uh, yes, the night tour, correct? Uh, yeah, we're a little early. Well, I'm afraid for safety purposes, the tours are only offered from 10 p.m. to midnight. What, just to be extra spooky? It'll be worth the wait, my friends. See you tonight. Shit, well now what do we do? We'll just have to wait. We can't afford to let anyone else go in or out of this gate. I agree, we're just gonna have to wait here till nighttime. Okay, how far away is that? Uh, about six hours. All right, just wait six hours and we're good to go. How long now? Still about six hours. Okay, cool. This sure is gonna be exciting in six hours. Shut up, Scott. 
Did anybody bring any uh, snacks or anything? Yeah, we should have brought snacks. Oh god, okay, how long now? Right around six hours still. Jesus, fuck. You know, kid, you still have yet to tap the full potential of your time-bending ass. 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 Something that could enhance your ability could possibly make time pass more quickly. The quickly. You see that AC fan over there? Right there, behind you. Over by the gate. On the left side. Can't miss it. If you fart into that fan, the oscillation of the gas will filter it through the expansion valve, mixing it with the pressurized refrigerant inside the condenser coils. 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 Don't question if that makes any sense, kid. Just fart in the fan. Go on. I'll fire it up for you right now. Oh, jeez. Some young people interested in genetic engineering, huh? Wonderful, please come in. Oh, hello. Oh, there's more. Hello, sir. My, my, there's a lot of you. Timmy! Well, I'm so pleased that you children are interested in genetic engineering. Genetic science began as a simple question. Can a monkey be made to have four asses instead of one? The answer was yes. And now we've been able to give more asses to pigs, horses, everything you can imagine. Yes, little boy. How does that help? Oh, you're one of the cynics, huh? Well, meet me over here for the tour and I'll show you how. Come on, don't be shy. We don't want to miss the four asses gorilla feeding. Please have a seat. You ever play that video game Half-Life? Okay, here we go. Here you can see our greenhouse. Genetic engineering is helpful to grow larger tomatoes, onions, cucumbers. Fruits and vegetables with more asses means more nutrition for people all around the planet. What good does that do? Oh, you Bible thumpers are all alike. Don't play God, you'll pay for it. <laughs> Let's continue up to the second level, shall we? Another benefit of genetic science, of course, is combining animals. Like these donkey apes, bunny fish, squirrel donkeys, and more. Once we put more asses on these, we will truly be benefiting science. Will you please explain how that benefits science at all? What's your name, little boy? Super Craig. You see, Super Craig, once we know how to do things to animals, we can hopefully apply them to mankind. You think having more asses is impossible? I tell you it's not. You see, genetic engineering is not just for animals and veggies. We are working towards helping people as well. Here you can see genetic mutations of my dead son. Most people don't remember that I once had a young child named Terrence. Oh yeah, I remember that kid. I was wondering whatever happened to him. Terrence was killed tragically in town when some kids were playing around with a relic belonging to Barbara Streisand. Oh jeez, I think that was us. So you're doing this all as a way to bring back your dead son? Bring him back? Well, of course not. I'm trying to give his dead body more asses so he can finally rest in peace. Now let's continue on to the fourth floor. Oh, fuck. Well, here we are. The top floor of the building and the end of our tour. What are these? These horrible, monstrous mistakes of science. Our new benefactor has asked that we genetically alter some of the local sixth graders and make them stronger and crazier. Okay, okay. Why the fuck would you do that? How do you mean? Why the fuck 
What'd you make genetically enhanced sixth graders? Calm down, Super Craig. How do you think we pay for all this? We have financial donors. Our latest benefactor has asked for this army of mutated sixth graders to protect his altered cats. What altered cats? Oh, right over this way. A wealthy benefactor named Mr. Connor has donated money to have stray cats enhanced with more asses. Our company can add asses to things at very competitive rates. Problem is that cats seem to become really aggressive when given more asses. They've proven to be quite deadly. Then why would you bring a bunch of kids up here? Look, there's nothing to worry about. This entire facility has a very complex security grid. Huh, that's never happened before. Oh shit, someone shut down the security grid. What do you mean? <laughs> Hello, Freedom Pals. What are you doing, fat ass? So you figured out my little plan, huh, Freedom Pals? Think you can stop me? Oh, I have someone here who'd like to say hello, new kid. Go on top. Guys! Guys, it's me, the king. Will you knock it off? Listen to me. Don't make any deals with this piece of garbage. He's an animal. Ah! That's enough out of you, kid. You've been a real pain in my ass, new kid. You should have known not to mess with Mitch Connor. Where the fuck are you? Mr. Connor, if you shut down the security grid, then everyone in this building is going to die. What? Sorry, Doc. Sometimes sacrifices have to be made for the greater good of the city. So long, Freedom Pass. Today is the last day of the rest of your life. I'm sorry, kids, but we're probably all going to die here. Oh, this fucking sucks. Beware, compadre! A kitty is on the move! Watch out for their claws and butts. <laughs> there. These little guys aren't messing around, super friends. <laughs> Make way for Mysterion. You won't see me coming. <laughs> Okay, I'm feeling a lot better about the door opening this time. Oh, I think this is it. Oh, no, I just let more cats out. How did trying to open the door make that happen? Make it this much a room. Ha, I'm all thumbs today. Fuck you, kitty. <laughs> Leave our friend alone, fiends! Well done, but I'm afraid you're still hopeless. Here I go. Curious. I hit that button three times and it did three different things. Meow. Ow! Show no weakness!
You know, I'm not sure this panel actually opens the door at all. Uh-oh, here's I've released more test subjects. You're no that for Captain Diabetes! Definitely should not have hit that button. I am out of fuck tickets. Asses beat their many asses. It just doesn't add up. My poor creatures. We must escape the lab. Maybe. Maybe we can go through some of the larger exhibits. This way, children. Hmm, it's gonna take a scientific approach to solve this one. Mutant sixth graders are on the loose. This was definitely not supposed to happen. Ugh, school's so dumb. Parents are dumb. Yeah, adults are stupid. Oh, Jesus. It's okay. We'll be safe in the tour tram. Oh, the tour tram is offline. Somebody's gonna have to get to the CPU and hit the override switch. Where's the CPU? Down on the third level. Oh, it was silly to put it there, wasn't it? So somebody has to walk down to the third level and flip the switch? One, two, three, not it. Not it. Not, not it. Not it. Not it. Not it. Not it. Not it. Sorry, new kid, but it really should be you anyway. Yeah, if you think about it, this is all kind of your fault. Ah, school is dumb. Ah, sixth grader! You need. Oh, hey, 
Hey there, new kid. Come here, little minion. There you go. Warrior, we will meet again. Okay, you should be coming to my dead son now. Just keep heading west. Those animals are angry because they have too many ashes. Oh my god, what the fuck are these? Fuck this place. Stupid little fourthies. <laughs> you like that fourthie? Got a lot more waiting for you in middle school. If nothing else, beating on you guys is really therapeutic for me. Huh? The nerve of that villain! Go nuts, new kid. Yeah, I saw that coming. That sucks for you, new kid. You're definitely in the wrong place at the wrong time. Huh? You don't get to go. I'll wipe my asses with you, fourthies. I'm going through a lot of stuff right now and needing to punch you with one of them. Ugh. These 
guys look like they want to push us around. Let's push them back. You did. <laughs> Prepare to meet your end. Here we go. <laughs> God, I hate you for these so bad. <laughs> Lights, teeth, whatever. Make a fist fight. Well, oh, you're in trouble now. Come here, twerp. You know how to take a hit, diabetes. Thanks for noticing, Super Craig. before things get awkward. It's my fucking turn, yeah. Mega bomb cut. Uh, ain't no fair. Uh, you think you're tougher than me? Well, you're not. Come here, Forthy. We lost one. Regroup. No mercy. <laughs> You're stupider than school and parents combined. You don't get to go. This was only going to end one way. Captain Ivy, 
into the fray. That's it. He's cleared the way. The CPU should be right through that door, kid. We'll come down and join you. Kid, thank God! You've got to stop him! He's out of his mind! Cartman, you fucking asshole! What are you doing? Connor brought me here, human cat. The sick son of a bitch- uh, You shut up, Coon. Soon this town will be rid of you and all the Coon friends. We're freedom pals, fat ass. We know what you're doing, Eric. Putting cat urine into people's drugs and alcohol to make them crazy. We want to know why. Yeah, why, you sick piece of- uh, Do I really have to spell it out, Coon? This city is sick. We both know it. There's only one time of year when this town is the way it should be. On Christmas! So I joined the Chamber of Commerce, and used them to unleash my master plan. Escalate crime in the city, blame crime on mayor, run for mayor, get tons of followers, clone new kid into genetic mutant, win election, make everyday Christmas. What do you think? Pretty sweet plan, right? Dude, quick! Take a selfie! Go on, look it over. Check... It for errors if you like. It's almost a shame that no one will ever know how perfectly my plan worked. Dude, you've gone too far this time. Nobody's gonna let you be mayor. Oh no, I've got all the new kids' followers. Every last one of them is now following me. Geez, that was smart. Eric, I know that Christmas every day sounds like fun, but it really wouldn't be. Fuck you, Dr. Timothy. If you guys don't mind, I've got an election to win. No, no. God damn it. Well, there goes the main CPU. Darn it, why did I put that thing on a mobilized trap door? Why wouldn't you? I'm afraid now someone will have to go clear to the ground level and call for the tour tram from there. All right, fine. Hurry up, new kid. We gotta get out of here. Yeah, new kid. Stop wasting time. It's okay, Mosquito. We're not... Got what you need. Hmm. Awesome.
fulfilled my duty, and now I must depart. Oh, looks like all the mutated animals have broken loose. Welp. <laughs> looks like you've run into mutant sixth graders. Oh, and they look hungry. Don't get eaten. to be removable in case anything wanted to attack people from below. Yeah! I took you to school, Forthy! I hate school. Fuck you, Badger. Uh, that's how we do it in the sixth grade, you little shit. Murphy's die! Soundproofing the walls in here so that no one could hear screams was not cheap, let me tell you. Tell them what you're made of, butthole!
Okay, who's the next target of my unbridled rage? Oh, oh come on. I'm not sorry for what I'm about to do. Retribution, but with inclusion. and I. You have to get me out of here. That computer is waiting for a DNA sample from your mother. Quick, she's in the next room. Go get mommy's DNA sample and bring it here. Hurry! to cut off your father's head to scan his DNA. I'm sorry, sweetheart, but you have to finish the job. The only way out of here is to kill Daddy. I heard that! What the hell is wrong with you? Can I have a conversation with our child without being criticized? Oh, you're the victim again, huh? Like you don't deconstruct everything I say. Okay, Mr. Never Wrong in its life. Go, go do it, sweetie. Go cut off Daddy's head. Hurry! What'd she say? Did she say how nothing is her fault, like usual? I knew something like this would happen, and it's why I've told your mother to keep her fucking mouth shut! Fuck you! I told you if our child's powers were discovered, they'd try to harvest our DNA and make a genetic clone! You did fucking not! Listen, kiddo. The CPU is waiting for either of our DNA. Just trick your mom into walking over to it. Don't make our child choose sides! trapped inside of a tube thingy. My legs are broken and my arm is almost ripped off. I could bleed to death if I move. You hear that? Go get mommy's arm. That should do it. Right thing, sweetheart. Now get out of here and go get help. Organic DNA sample accepted.
hands with all these butts! There we go. You see, that wasn't so hard, was it? What took you so long, new kid? You just screwing around having fun? Freedom Pals, we've got to get out to the town and tell everyone what Cartman is doing. I don't think so, guys. You came all this way just to die, Coon and Friends. Freedom Pals! Coon and Friends. Freedom Pals! Coon and Friends, Coon and Friends, Coon and Friends! Careful, guys. He's got some kind of super weapon. It's over, fat ass. We're gonna tell everyone on you. Yeah, you hear that, Connor? <laughs> Sick son of a bitch. Ah! You shut up, Coon. We need each other, don't you get it? I create the crime and you stomp it out. I am good for your franchise. Oh, fuck, I get it now. But then the new kid had to come along and try to stop me for good. I had no choice but to have my own new kid built. What have you done, Eric? Simple. How do you stop a coon friend? By creating a massive, genetically altered coon friend from that hero's DNA. What? Oh, dude, that's so fucking base. What, what do you mean, King? Really? You're just gonna fight a superhero by creating a big genetic mutant from the hero's DNA? That's like every douchebag superhero movie ever. Yeah, because it's key. It's not key. No, no, it's cool because it's like the ultimate enemy. Oh, give me a break. Well, anyways, I wasn't able to finish getting the new kid's DNA, so I had to resort to cloning a different superhero. Which superhero? <laughs> Prepare for battle, weaklings! <laughs> 